Let's go check out that tower. I'll come with. It's in pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. Sam, look. That's Christopher Condon's sigil. He's uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon, operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. Well, maybe each captain was responsible for a tower, along with providing the men for it. Whatever the case, this certainly isn't our final stop on our tour. Some big plans for this winch. There, that ought to do it. Deeper than it looks. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Steady. Steady. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, not yet. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine, you've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. Ha, <laughs> poor oppressed pirate. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. Taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor. Patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. I'll be right back. Uh, okay, so uh, you're not interested. I am. Just checking something out. Sam, you were saying? Oh, that's right, I was. Uh, anyway, do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa, and they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a former squid. The point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah, well, still taking a long time. How would you look at that? Oh, shit! Stop! Stop! I see him. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. That means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. You do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead.
Hurry! They're over here! Okay, I think that's it. God damn it, Rafe and Nate must have dozens of guys out there. They, they could just stumble on us. Oh no, Nate! Look, another sigil. Huh. Adam Baldridge. He ran King's Bay for a while. He was a traitor, slaver, general scoundrel. Look at you. Yeah. Prison. A lot of books. Looks like that bridge leads back to the trail.
Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? Again with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. No, turn into it. Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Rafe? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of mercenary. The Rafe's got the... Look, shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. He's thinking the same damn thing. But they found the treasure already. Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, yeah you're right. Hey, Sam, if you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. Pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. Didn't come with airbags, parachutes. You know, come to think of it, I actually dealt with Alcazar a few decades ago, even before I met you two. Oh shit! Oh! Looks like Shoreline found something. Go slow. You got it. Sorry, you were saying? Um, oh, right. Oh, yeah. Where are shoreline Yeah. Here they are!
we're talking about... Um... Oh, right. Oh, shit. How are you still alive? Well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Still working his way up the criminal ladder then. I sold his boss a few woodcut prints I'd smuggled out of Japan. He was into shoguns and such. Alcazar was the go-between. Check it out, boys. What is it? Hey guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? I can't tell. Would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Drawbridge. How well, medieval. Yeah. Well, you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to keep people out. Or protect something inside. <laughs> Nathan, check this out. Oh, hell, the stairs are busted. There's no way up to the crank. I'll see if I can find something to stand on. Huh. Shoreline must have been here before. Find his keepers. Be careful, kid. There's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam! Rush up the river! Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, kid. You all right? I'm fine. You all right? Yeah. You got this? Mm-hmm. I see you. I'll bring the car closer. <laughs> Are you two just relax? I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know? 
Keep up the good work, kid. Shoreline show up. Hey. Now, let's get that bridge down. Let's try that again. There we go. Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? Nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? <sighs> Gonna take a look around. So, just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist. Which is worth 400 million. Right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure. Well, you should have told him it was 200 down. You never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. I wasn't exactly expecting to be partners with him. <sighs> <sighs> Set. Here we go. Uh oh. Don't panic. Don't panic. Don't panic. Ah! 
Come on, come on! You okay? I've been better. Get us out of this, kid. All right, hang on. Now, Mary, pull the grace of the Lord is with you. Bless all the evil women and bless the people they walk. Easy, kid. Easy. Ah. Well, that was fun, right? Yeah, well, I'm definitely sharing this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. Had the whole thing under control. to something. Find our way in. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. <laughs> Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. See what we got here. Huh. Looks like there's something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Damn. It's breaked over. All right, let's look around. Careful with that thing, kid. Ugh. Heads up! God, Jesus! I said heads up! He's got a lot riding on this. See a treasure, though. You guys, coming. Come check this out. Saint Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas too. And that's, uh... Um, that's Adam Baldridge, that's uh, Joseph Farrell, and that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh... Let's see, what do you think the trick is here? Gotta push a button, pull something? Uh, maybe... Maybe one of the arms, or... Yeah, give it a shot. Whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this.
trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Hector, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's gotta be in one of them, right? <laughs> yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here. Hope so. You okay? Yeah, yeah, fine. Sam? Yeah, over here. Uh. Hey, what are you doing? It's confirming a suspicion. Shh. Look at this. They figured out the towers, too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed, okay? Because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Well, that's great, Nathan, because neither do we. Yes, we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, are you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. But still, two beats the hell out of 12. All right, I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that one. No, 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 no. no, no Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly, so if we wanna have a chance to catch them, then we've gotta split up. Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. Damn it. If you run into any of those shoreline clouds, you call us, okay? See you soon. Come on, Nate. We gotta hurry. Yeah. All right, there's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the middle of a goddamn market? Oh, yeah, that'd be crazy. But we've seen crazy before. That we have. Excuse me. 
Hey guys, seen any uh, pirate treasure out here? Hey, hey. Sorry, he's so impatient. Oh, hell. I am sorry. I, here, let me help you. My mistake. I apologize for my friend. I haven't fed him in a while. Take care. You see the way she looked at me? <laughs> you are delusional. Sorry, sorry. So why don't you invite her back for some spicy bread? It's a lemur. Come on, come say hi. That's all right. <laughs> so cute. Whoa! Hey! Hey, Sully! Hey! He stole my apple! Can't trust anyone these days. You know what? After this is over and done with, I'm gonna get a dog. Hey, come out of this in one piece, I'll buy you the damn dog. Can I name it Victor? <laughs> sure. Hey, Nate, want me to buy you one of these? Sully, you gotta be crazy to wear a shirt like that. Ah, crazy handsome. <laughs> <laughs> 